Hello friends, my name is Muhammad Ashar and in our last video we learned how we can uh, configure uh, to run ORDS services automatically whenever Windows restarts. And in today lecture we will learn how we can create workspace on our uh, local system. Uh, basically workspace uh, is a container uh, for your applications you create in Oracle Apex. So whenever you start uh, learning Apex, uh, workspace creation is mandatory so that you can uh, create your applications in workspace. So uh, uh, let's start how we can create workspace in Oracle Apex on our local system. So uh, first of all, open your browser, access your uh, local host address ORDS and uh, here we have uh, default workspace internal username admin and the password is uh, capital S A M dollar sign one two three apex okay so uh, uh, here uh, you uh, can see a uh, uh, little bit uh, 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 explanation before you get started please take a moment to create a workspace a workspace is a shared work area where multiple developers can build uh, uh, applications once created sign in to your workspace to begin building applications return to administrator services to create additional workspaces or to manage this oracle apex instance so uh, click on uh, create workspace here we ha had to uh, provide a uh, workspace name which is uh, mandatory so uh, uh, let's take a unique name hmis and workspace id is auto generated generated uh, take it a code Camp. Okay. Uh, code camp, which is my channel name and workspace uh, description. It is just for learning purpose only. And click on next. So uh, reuse uh, existing schema. No. Yes, uh, because we don't have, uh, so we are selecting no. Uh, schema name, let me check, is there any schema? So by default, we have HR uh, schema. Let me check uh, if I click yes, then uh, here we have uh, HR, GM Motors, uh, and Arshad. Okay, uh, let's create it now. Click it. Yes, because we already using uh, existing uh, schema which is HR uh, if you don't want to use uh, then you can create your own schema we click on this and here we have schema name Arshad this 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 click on Arshad and schema password here we have password Radical space quota MB uh, uh, 500 MB and you can increase it as per your requirements. Next, schema already exists. Okay, then we have to create 
uh, yes if we uh, are using already uh, available schemas uh, okay click it on no and provide schema name or oh, uh, schema name uh, let's suppose you know we have a schema code underscore m let me check what it says otherwise uh, click with yes and provide a schema name Ashad. okay okay go with no and provide schema name M password next and then we have administrator or uh, username password first name last name so uh, what is the administrator username which you will use to uh, log into your workspace uh, actually this is your workspace administrator username so uh, name it m arsha and password uh, keep your passwords uh, same so that uh, you can remember your passwords easily s capital k m dollar sign uh, one two three a our first name is and then we have email go next and then uh, you will you can see your workspace name is code camp uh, our workspace id system assigned id and here we have description of our workspace administrator username is emerson email is this one and existing uh, we are not using any existing schema and schema name is code camp okay uh, uh create workspace workspace uh created done so uh this is uh your overall uh, application uh, overview where you can manage your workspaces here you have you can see uh, your role is administrator and workspace we are using is internal now and a uh, uh, email which we are using is uh, muhammad.rashi.fail at the rate of gmail.com so sign out from this workspace uh, return to sign in page and here we have our own newly created workspace which is called M and uh, username is M Arshad and password is S capital M dollar sign one two three A remember my workspace sign in so uh, whenever you uh, create your uh, workspace and log in with your uh, newly created workspace so uh, this is mandatory to change your uh, password so uh, current password as capital pm dollar sign one two three a and then we have to create a new password then S capital K M. Uh, now I am using at the rate of instead of dollar sign uh, one two three A, and confirm the password S K M uh, 
at the rate of 123a and create change password so uh, we have uh, created a new workspace on our local machine uh, successfully here we have uh, uh, apex a uh, browser based apex ide where you can uh, develop your uh, applications manage your applications and a lot of stuff over here so we will uh, do a overview of uh, this uh, complete ide in our next videos uh, thank you thank you so much